So I know this is a little bit old news to a lot of you guys, but fucking Bob Ross was on Twitch. Fucking Bob Ross, dude. And look, I know I don't stream on Twitch, and I know that I have nothing to do with the Twitch community, but dude, the fact that Bob Ross was a part of something that's pretty much only gaming related is pretty fucking awesome. And if you don't know who Bob Ross is, first things first, I'm sorry. No, but seriously though, Bob Ross was just a guy that used to teach people how to paint, dude. Just a great guy. He's one of those people that you'll just be walking down the street, right? No big deal. And then you see him there, teaching people how to fucking paint, right? And you'll sit there watching for 30 minutes. You'll put your arm around a homeless guy, and you'll be like... That is what humanity needs. But I was talking about it on Twitter, and a lot of people were like, Leafy, you're talking about Bob Ross so much. Why don't you start streaming, huh? Why don't you start painting and streaming? I would love to watch a stream like that. Hey, no peer pressure. Give me your lunch money, though, huh? Give me your fucking lunch money. No, but there's always been people asking me ever since I started this YouTube channel, Yo, Leafy, why don't you stream a little bit? And the reason being why I don't stream is, it just seems so much harder than making a YouTube video. Like a YouTube video, I go downstairs, I get a cup of coffee, I go back upstairs, I pour the coffee on my head and the computer and I just talk for like five minutes and people seem to really like that And look, maybe I'm looking at this from the wrong perspective, right? But for streaming the way I see it is you drink your cup of coffee and you walk over to your computer chair Sit down. You got to be entertained for the next eight hours like shit Like look, I think I could do it for one hour I think I could maybe even do it for two hours, but six hours bro on the seventh hour. I'm just gonna be like this Fuck that guy maybe occasionally just to keep everyone awake just throw in one of these <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> So, uh, when I record a video, I usually listen to it back every 45 seconds or so just to make sure everything is good. I just heard that last part. What the fuck on any level? <laughs> Dude, straight up, it sounded like some sort of squid monster from, like, a scary movie. Someone goes, rainy day, opens up the closet door. There's all this anticipation in the air. Opens up the closet door. All these tentacles come out, just go... <laughs> And the funny thing is, is a lot of people think I watch like an ass load of scary movies because I make up all these scenarios. But I hardly watch any scary movies whatsoever. Like, I guess I'll watch one every now and then. But I kind of like avoid them, dude. I'm not big on scary movies. Especially when I was growing up, dude. I fucking hated that shit. Like, I remember when I was like six years old and my mom was watching the movie Signs, right? I walked over and I was kind of watching it for a bit. And the quote unquote disturbing scene came up and it scared the living shit out of me. Like, when that motherfucking alien popped up on the screen, dude, it wasn't like, oh my god, that was really frightening, or, whoa, wow, that was really scary. Like, straight up, when that alien popped up on the screen, dude, instantly, I just started crying. I was, I was fucking done, dude. Like, I'm sure everybody has that one movie as a kid that scared the fucking shit out of them. This movie scarred the shit out of me, dude. And the funniest thing about this whole thing is this movie isn't even intended to be like a horror movie. Like, this isn't like Friday the 13th where it's like, you're supposed to be fucking scared, bro. This movie was like about this dude that like stopped believing in fucking God or some bullshit, right? And he was like supposed to refund. Like, it was like a Christian somewhat movie. And it scarred the shit out of me, dude. That alien. Just that fucking alien, dude. Just that one fucking alien, dude. You know what? Fuck all aliens, dude. I just hate aliens. I don't know what it is about them. I don't care if they're little green men or they're tall green ass dudes. They're just so spooky. Like, I just don't like them whatsoever. Like, I'm okay with skeletons, spooky skeletons coming to stab you. That, I'm okay with that, okay? I'm okay with people breaking into your house and are like, I'm going to kill you and then rape your dead body. I'm okay with that too, dude. I'm okay with all these motherfuckers. I'm okay with ghosts too. Ghosts don't scare me whatsoever. Little girl ghosts, they're not scary whatsoever. But little green men that abduct you into their spaceship and probe the shit out of you. Yo, I'm not cool with that. You guys probably think I'm joking too. No, hashtag fuck the aliens, dude. Fuck them, dude. I hate the aliens, but we're gonna end it on that, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. Leave a like or the aliens are gonna get you. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support and peace, peace. Stay safe. The aliens are out there.